Good evening, everybody. For many of us, our pets are like family, which makes our story tonight that much harder to understand. When 17 cats were rescued from a Butler County home, they looked like this. But tonight, they're getting a second chance. Local 12's Angela Ingram is in the newsroom with how volunteers came to their rescue. Angela. Cammie, the woman keeping the cat surrendered them voluntarily and these cats were neglected for some time and now they're suffering from a number of health issues as a result of it. Persian cats Opal and Pearl are at Monroe Family Pet Hospital, finally getting the medical care they've needed for years. One of the cats is missing an eye. Volunteers with Joseph's Legacy rescued the two and 15 others from a home in Middletown on Sunday. The stench when you walked in was like you literally could not breathe. One had a... Um, a pretty big sore that they actually need to have surgery on. The cats were all in cages in a room that volunteers say was only eight by eight. The owner turned them over voluntarily after a worker in the neighborhood found out the animals were inside of the home. Somehow they opened up that they had these cats upstairs in a room and that, you know, they would be willing to give them to a rescue that would foster and find homes for them. Three of the cats went to All About Pet Care in Middletown. These two, Charles and Miles, will likely be okay, but this one had to be put to sleep because it was in such bad shape. They were all very thin, um, emaciated, especially the one um, that we lost. Uh, they all are very severely matted, uh, which is definitely a sign of neglect, uh, had fleas, most likely intestinal parasites as well. Some volunteers are fostering the cats, but they do need more help. Right now, the focus is on getting these Persians healthy so that they can go to good homes. We're just glad that we were able to hopefully uh, take one step in saving a pretty significant number of animals um, that were in pretty deplorable conditions. Volunteers say the woman gave a number of conflicting stories about why she had the cats in those conditions. Joseph's legacy has reported the incident to authorities and they will decide whether the woman will be charged. Live in the newsroom, Angela Ingram, Local 12 News. Cami, back to you. All right, Angela, thank you. And if you are interested in fostering or adopting a cat once they're healthy, we have a link on local12.com.